What's up guys? Welcome to this series where we are explaining you the code that you guys request us uh, through our comments. Uh, now, uh, those who want uh, directly want the source code, uh, it will be available uh, in the description. Uh, please do like our videos and subscribe them and pro provide a suggestion. Now your support will help us grow and make better videos for you. Uh, so uh, now let's jump on what we are going to do today. We are going to write a program to find the area and the parameter of a circle. Now this is a fairly uh, simple program and I guess we should uh, be uh, getting this over quite quickly. Now let's see. Now uh, this is just I prepared a slide just showing you uh, the perimeter and the area where the, the actual a if you want to the formula for area of circle is pi r square right the r is the radius and uh, for parameter it, it, it is 2 pi r now this pi is uh, 22 by 7 or it is 3.1415 and it's recurring if you want the accurate value you can uh, google it now uh, for those who don't know what's perimeter that's the black one and for the area is the blue one now uh, let's jump on to the code now I just created a file named circle.c and just uh, we'll start with this uh, standard procedure that is we'll include the stdio for input output. Now just try let's write down the main. Now let's see uh, how many variables do we actually need for this. Now first we'll be requiring pi. So let's define pi. Now pi is a floating point value so it will be float. I'll define it as pi and I'll give it a value as 3.1415. Now the accurate value of pi is actually greater than this. You can google it and get the more accurate value if you want to get an accurate uh, area. Now uh, other than this we'll just be requiring a variable called radius and we'll also be requiring uh, two more variables that is for perimeter and we'll be requiring area so after we have declared these variables now let's start by asking the user to input the radius So let's give a message, enter, enter the radius. So after we have done this, we'll just scan the input from the user, we'll write scanf. Now this percent %f is for floating point values and the input is taken in radius. So after we have scanned the input, now all we need to do is apply our formula. So if you remember the formula of area, it was pi into r square, right? So pi into radius into radius. So this will give us the area and for the perimeter the formula was 2 pi r, right? So perimeter equal to 2 pi and r that's the radius okay so now we have done our um, main calculation part now let's print out the out, uh, output for the user area of circle is we'll have percent f and perimeter is percent f and we'll just supply the values which are in area and perimeter so now that we have done we have completed our program now let's uh, run the uh, first compile the code to see if we have any errors okay so no errors now so let's run it 
now it's asking us for the radius now we'll enter radius as 10 so our area is uh, 314.14 something and the perimeter is 62.83002 now we have successfully executed our code to find the area and perimeter of the circle i hope you have understood everything uh, now if you have any doubts you can comment in the comment section uh, we'll be happy to help you out we are expecting your support you like our videos please do like our videos subscribe them now this will help us improve and uh, get better videos to you thank you